How is it going guys? It's Kevin from Subi Speed. Wow, I feel like I do one of these every single week, but this year has absolutely flown by and it's time for a new products video. If you guys haven't already done so be sure to click the subscribe button down below so you can stay up to date on any new install videos product reviews and coverage of any of the events that we go to also visit our website and click on that new products tab so you can see all the new products that we are constantly adding to start it all off we've got a product that you 2018 guys have been patiently waiting for which is in this box right here these are our subi speed 2018 drl fog light bezels you've got an led strip up top an opening for your fog light and these are finished off in a black pearl paint they come with everything you need to get them installed as well i'll have a separate install video out for these soon now that we've got that out of the way we can take a look at some of the new wheels that have come in this month i've got some volk wheels in a brand new takata green finish specifically these are the t37 sagas with the machine logo these are volk's staple wheel with the classic six spoke design that they continue to improve upon for example the cutouts on the back of the spokes to reduce and minimize the weight these weigh in at just 18.35 pounds. And then on the other side, we have the Z40s, which are a 10 spoke design, and those weigh in at just 18 and a half pounds. So these are super lightweight, high performance wheels. They're available in an 18 by nine and a half and an 18 by 10 in this brand new Takata green finish. To top off the wheels, we have the Advan Racing RG3s in an umber bronze finish. These are in the 18 by nine and a half plus 45 fitment and they feature a unique side cut six spoke design that has them weighing in at just 18.25 pounds. So these are even lighter than the freaking T37 Sagas. Moving on from the wheels, I always see online in the Facebook groups, people complaining about getting in a hit and run or in an accident where even though it wasn't their fault, the other person tries to put the blame on them, which is exactly why we carry dash cams. We actually have one installed on this car, and this here is the Blackview DR900S. That's the newest addition to their lineup. Uh, you can get this either with the just the front camera or both the front and rear. It features an eight megapixel sensor that can record 4K ultra high definition video so you can clearly see the license plates and exactly what happened in the case of an accident. It also has built-in impact and motion detection. So when it's in parking mode, even though it's always active, it doesn't actually write to the card until something sets off those sensors. Once those go off, it actually has a couple seconds of video in its buffer memory that it writes to the card. So you're able to see exactly what happens so if you're looking to protect your car and get some more peace of mind pick up one of these blackview dash cams next on the list we have the plm dual track pipe muffler deletes now these aren't exactly brand new but when they first came out they were only available with the blue tips and now they're available in the classic stainless steel tips these are made out of 304 tig welded stainless steel they weigh in at just 16 pounds and these are three and a half inch tips so you're going to be able to get rid of those heavy stock mufflers and get a more aggressive exhaust note out of your car a more performance oriented part that we've got in this month are the wave spec rotors. These were developed to increase your braking performance while simultaneously decreasing rotating mass. As you can see, they have a unique design that actually reduces rotating mass, increases surface area to volume ratio to transfer more heat to the air, and has more leading edges to improve initial bite and keep from buildup. They basically have three different lines. They've got their sport line, which is ideal for a daily driver that does the occasional autocross. And then they have their silver line, which is going to improve upon that brake pad bite and durability. And then we have the black line, which I have here, which has an increase in hardness and temperature stability, as well as excellent wear resistance and stopping power. And it's coated in black zinc to prevent rust. Now, before you run off to the comments section and totally blast me about these being an absolute gimmick, hear me out. Now, at first looking at these, I thought so too. I thought to myself, it looks like they reduced the contact patch between the rotor and the brake pad. How would that benefit you at all? But Audi runs a very similar design to these on their R8 and RS7. So I gotta believe that there are some sort of benefits to be had with this sort of design. We're gonna take a look at some aesthetic mods real quick, starting off with the OLM SCI style rear diffuser with red striping. 
Same one we have installed on our Forester, but this one has a gloss black finish with red accenting running across. So if you're looking to change up the rear end of your car, that's another option for you. We're gonna hop inside the SCI real quick, and I'm gonna show you the OLM Carbon Fiber SCI Shifter Cover. Now in a previous vlog, I showed you Erie all the way from Japan came over here and test fitted this, and gosh, it fits absolutely perfectly. I'm super impressed with how well this fit and seeing how much time and effort he took to testing everything and making sure all the edges were perfect, I can see it in the final product. It even has the cutout for the SCI logo and it just slides right in and it, it looks OEM. It gets rid of all that silver and completely changes how the interior of this car looks. It has a nice gloss finish with that carbon weave and it's super easy to install. It has pre-applied 3M on the back. All you have to do is peel the backing off of that 3M, slide it into place and you're golden. Outside of the car, not too far away, we have the Carbon Reproductions Carbon Fiber Mirror Covers. Now this one is the one with the turn signal cutout, but when these first came out, we had a bunch of requests for ones without the turn signal cutout, and they are now finally available. So if you are someone without the turn signals but wanted that carbon fiber cover, you can now get them on our website. Speaking of turn signals, while we're here, I went ahead and took this apart and I wanted to show you guys the OLM mirror turn signal indicators. Now, on the front side, there is a small black rectangle on the outer side that you'll see that's practically useless. We're gonna replace that black one with a clear one that allows the turn signal to shine through to improve your visibility to other drivers. It's super easy to install, probably have its own install video out maybe next week, maybe in a two minute Tuesday video, we'll see. Sticking with the carbon fiber theme we had going on before that last product, we have the Charge Speed Carbon Fiber Grill Finishers. These are imported directly from Japan and they are handcrafted carbon fiber pieces that fit directly on your 2018 front grill across the middle section there. So if you are into carbon fiber accenting, you certainly wanna add these to your list. Yo actually just walked in and told me to add this product to the new products video. This is our Subi Speed SCI carbon fiber gurney flap that was also featured in a previous vlog. So let me open this up for you guys. All right, so here it is, a little bit different than the prototype that we installed on a local customer car. This section right here, which actually lays on top of your SCI wing, is a little bit thicker, but it does have the same design, same aggressive design that was on that prototype with the kickback in the middle section right here to give it that aggressive look. So if you're looking for something to add to your SCI spoiler to give it a little bit more downforce and give you that nice aesthetic look, certainly check these out. Almost forgot we also have the carbon fiber door trim covers made by the same person that did the SCI shifter cover. Again, these fit perfectly where they're supposed to. You're gonna get a full set front rear on both sides. They install super easy again with pre-applied 3M. Just peel the backing off, clean your door trim, and then place them into the correct spot. That pretty much wraps it up for the parts for the WX and SCI this month. We're gonna jump over to the BRZ side of things with the 8.6 here. We've got two new products installed on this car right now. This one up top here is the OLM rear window roof visor. It's gonna change the side profile of the car. Probably adds a little bit of downforce as well. Can't tell you how much, probably minimal, but it is a nice aesthetic piece to add. Super easy to install. Got pre-applied 3M on the back, just peel that off, wipe down your window, make sure it's clean, line it up, and then you can plop that on there. Moving down, we're gonna have two different types of spoilers. This one here is the Carbon Reproductions TRD style carbon fiber spoiler. It's more of like a duckbill type spoiler. If you want a more traditional type spoiler, you can look into the NS style spoiler, which has gloss black ends and a carbon fiber center. This type of spoiler can be found on models, on different models overseas that we don't get over here, so we wanted to make this available for you guys here. Last but not least, we've got the Ray's Gram Lights 57C6 in a luminous yellow for you guys. These are in an 18 by nine and a half plus 40 fitment with a concave thin six spoke design and they weigh in at 22.15 pounds. Jumping over to the Forester, I apologize in advance, I've only got one part this month, but it is the parent license plate relocation kit. So if you're looking for a different option to mount your license plate, rather than drilling holes into the middle of your bumper, you can pick up the parent kit that installs into the tow hook location and then you can mount your license plate onto that. To end off the month, we've got the OLM carbon fiber mirror covers for you Impreza guys with turn signal mirrors. And that wraps up the new products for this month. If you guys like what you saw, check out the links down in the description. If you guys have any questions at all, feel free to email us or give us a ring. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on our latest videos. I'll see you guys next time.
so you're able to see exactly what happened in the case of and i already said that Fuck. ah i cut it into two parts with the classic six spoke design god right next to me i've got some volk wheels in a brand new takata green hey you come do this i need a teleprompter and they feature a unique a unique New, bleh, can't talk. Unique six, unique side cut six spoke design. And replace it with a clear piece. And now your turn signal. That's not right. 